Hello, my peepers. This is Shalene of the Color and Book Nook, and I have two Treasure Studios Arts unboxing to do. One is for me, and one is a Christmas gift for someone for Christmas, of course. I am still going to unbox it, hoping I can get it back into the box, because I'm not diamond painting it. The person likes to diamond paint. So, first thing is the first kit. You get your tool kit, which has this cute bag that says Treasure Studios Art. It is not poured glue, it is not double sided adhesive. It is, hold on, I have it written down. Um, mounted adhesive. Is that the only one I have? I know I have it written. It's a mountain adhesive anyways. I have it written down in one of the other boxes. <laughs> and I always say it wrong. Yeah. Mounted film adhesive. Okay, so you get your drill pen. It's sparkly. It has your single tip. It has space. It has multi placers. You have a three. I don't know what they all are. I'm not good at that stuff. You have a squishy to put on the pen. You have your tweezers. They're round. I like the pointed better, but I do use these. You get two things of wax and your little tray. So that is what comes in your toolkit. And I'll put that aside. So I have not opened this yet. It just came. I see that they come in new boxes. It says diamond to draw. And diamond painting, it still does not say Treasure Studios Art on the box. But it does show, hmm, let's see if I can do this. It does show a picture. Can you see that? So this one is The Witch Is In by Lizzie Falcon. It's a 50 by 65. I like Lizzie Falcon. Okay, so we'll take this out. Because of the adhesive, do not ever roll this the other way around. Always roll it in this direction or you will ruin the canvas. No. I should have raised. Hold on. I'm going to try to raise up. Hold on. Okay, I was trying to, to have it so you could see this better. Um, she does not do the scalloped edges for unfraying like some companies do. There, there's 35 colors. And here is your DMC code and your symbols which are very, very clear. I'm looking to see if we have any that are like really close. Maybe these two greens might be a little bit harder, but um, everything else looks okay on here. So do you want to see this? Look at that. Yes. Look at the witch. Love it. It does say Treasure Studios Art on the top. You have your other schematic here on the left. 
with the picture, the size, <coughs> the title. And down here, it tells their social medias. The only thing is, I wish that they told on here who the artist is. But that's okay. It does tell the picture name and all that. Do you want to see how clear these uh, symbols are? Let's peel this back a little bit. This is so pretty. So pretty. So there's your symbols. They are very, very clear. I think you can see them. Very, very clear. No issues. Like I said, do not fold it the other way or roll it. You've got to make sure you keep it rolled the way that she had it. And let's look at the drills. <coughs> you do get an inventory sheet. It is in color. So you get your inventory sheet. It is in color. Now you could cut these out and tape them onto your containers. Um, you can work out of the bags. Now I'm doing a Treasure Studios art now that I'm working out of the bags instead of containers. I hate it. <laughs> But I'm almost done with it, so I'm continuing to work out of the bags, but I will not do that again. It's a pain in the butt. It is for me. It might not be for you. So this tells you The Witch is In by Lizzie Falcon. It's a 50 by 65, and they are round. And then it tells you their website, their email, Instagram, and Facebook. So, yeah. There is that. So what... What I do, I like to work off the paper because sometimes I can't see. It depends on where I am on the canvas. I might not be able to see the schematic, so I work off the paper. So sometimes I make a copy of the paper, and I have a sticker sheet for my printer. So I could print this on the sticker sheet and cut out the symbol and the DMC color. I can cut this out and put it on the container. So let's see what their colors are like. Holy crap. Look at that big bag of 310. 310s. Now 310s usually you get trash. See there's already some. I already see some trash just because they're malt. They're um bulk made you know is that another 310 nope that's a 939 look at the static and that's in a separate bag they must have had an issue with it oh because there's more than what would fit in there now the kit I'm working on now they aren't full of static but there's like four different colors they are totally stuck together really, really hard. I had to buy a grinder, and that's not even always taking them apart. So I'm hoping I don't have that issue with these because I tried taking them apart by my hands, but sometimes one will go flying. So, yeah, we have some really pretty colors. See the pretty colors? So, yeah, I tried working out of the bags, like I said, and just pouring into the tray and then back into the bags, and I'm not liking that. I don't see any of these where they are stuck together like the kit I'm working on. And they're not static. They're really, really stuck hard. Yeah, maybe a, maybe a few of them. I did take a rolling pin across the bag a few times but one of the bags I rolled it a few times and it put a hole in the bottom of the bag so then I had to put the bag inside another bag like this is but yeah I like working out of the containers way better hmm 
<laughs> we have some hitchhikers. So pretty colors. Pretty colors. No ABs. I don't know if they do ABs in any of their canvases. I'm not sure. So yeah, there is all the colors for that. Let's get them in here. And then I will show you the other diamond painting kit. I usually can get them all back in the boxes. <laughs> so the other one, I will tr I will really make sure I can get it back in the box because that is a Christmas gift. And like I said, I am not doing it because the person likes to diamond paint. I mean, I can say who it is. He's going to know who it's for. But he doesn't watch my videos, so I am not worried about that. So let's get this here. Get this here. I cannot wait. To work on this. I don't know when I'm going to get to this. Because I know it can count for drills and chills and Halloween, but I the one I'm finishing now, I already have the next one picked out. Okay. So there is that. Let's see if I can get it back into the box. I probably can't get it back in the plastic bag. I could if I wanted to try really hard, but for, this is for me, so it's just going in the box. Okay. And the next one, of course, you get the same kit. It's the same thing. I will set that aside for him. And... Yes, it's for my son. It's for my oldest son. So I got him Dragon Sword. Because he loves dragons. His I'm going to work really hard to get back into this bag. This will keep him busy for a while. So it says Treasure Studios Art. And again, do not roll it the opposite way. It has your picture and the name of the canvas, Dragon Sword, a 50 by 65. And there is 29 colors. 29 colors. So let's look at this. Oh yeah. He is going to love this. Look at that. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to give this to him. I would like to get him another nice diamond paint and pen to go with this. Okay, so here's your symbols. They're very clear. I don't have this on autofocus, but they are very, very clear. Like I said, you get your schematic on the top left and the bottom right. 
Let's look at the drills. This is gorgeous. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. I keep hitting my, my camera. Okay, so here are all the colors. Let's see. So here is your inventory sheet. There's 29 colors. It's a round dragon sword by Nicole Payne, 50 by 65. I don't know if he's done squares, but I got him a round. And these are all the beautiful drills. Oh, look at that. His favorite color is blue, but that's a more of a purple. And I believe it is. One of them likes black and one boy likes blue. I can't remember. But I would like to get him like a fiery looking diamond paint and pen. He has a nice diamond paint and pen he bought himself online. And I bought him a Halloween one. And now I would like to get him something like a that'll go with this. Look at all the pretty colors. Oh, we got hitchhikers. And he does have storage containers. He has the containers. I hope that he has enough to do one this size. Might have to buy him a couple Harbor Freights. I'm not sure what he has. He may have the TikTok containers. So, yep. That is all the colors. Very, very pretty. Thank you, Treasure Studios Art. I cannot wait till he sees this. <laughs> he loves his dragons. So that is everything that I have from mm, Treasure mm, Studios Art. Mm, mm. I do have another one ordered. I have the working for Halloween that's for the collab that a couple people are doing. I am hoping it's here on time, but I don't even know if I'll be able to get to it on time when they start the collab. Depends on how quick my... Halloween one works up. So there is that. And yeah. Roll this up as tight as I can to get it back into that plastic bag. <laughs> And that is it for today. I have more unboxings you will be seeing this week. So stay tuned for more of those. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you all guys later. Bye-bye.